Uh, one of the major projects, one of the major fo focuses of the lab has been to actually treat patients with a cancer therapy. And as I mentioned before, uh, it's in, the white cells are supposed to recognize malignant cells. They are foreign and um, they should be recognizing them, sequester the, sequestering them, and destroying them. And um, obviously when a tumor rises, the system has not worked the way it should have been. So what we have been doing is to take out white cells from cancer patients and we put them into a test tube with a little tiny piece of their tumor, not a whole cell, but what's called a peptide, a little tiny protein bit, um, to educate these cells and say, hey, you know, this is what you were supposed to be recognizing and this is what you were supposed to be targeting um, in your immune response. So what we did was to educate them in a test tube and we actually infuse them back into patients with cancer. We have treated patients with B-cell lymphoma, with um, prostate cancer, lung cancer, um, uh, liver cancer. And um, what we found that patients with B-cell lymphoma were incredibly responsive to this therapy. And um, that's because we had a protein that was very specific. Every B-cell lymphoma from every patient has a specific little bit on it that's distinctive from any other bit. And um, so in that way, we could target very readily these cells to uh, the tumor. And uh, it was an extremely successful therapy, a therapeutic mode. Unfortunately, every single patient had to be treated. We have to make this huge vaccine. We have to make the cells. And it was cost prohibitive. but extremely successful and um, it shows that we're on the right track and that we now have to um, work with other types of tumors to see if we can figure out exactly what system works for each particular tumor.